in this room who knew and, uh, and remember Bob. And for those of you who did not, um, you missed out. Um, one of the things I learned from Harry Britt uh, is, <laughs> um, is that really great people are defined by you know, a lot of traits, but one of them is their anger. Um, and the things that get them upset, and the things that they rage against. And one of the things that's great about this room is that it's filled with people who rage against the terrible things that are happening in the world. Brian Basinger. Um, Bob was a wonderful man filled with incredible rage. He raged against Sutter Health. He hated Sutter. And he hated every anyone or any entity uh, that, would, that would put private profit above, above people's health. And he, he, he raged against Nancy Pelosi and the Democratic leaders in Congress and at the state level. Tom Ammiano was just about the only elected Democrat that Bob Polzoni could even remotely stand. Um, and he raged. That's Tom Ammiano, everybody. And he raged against people in our own queer community who either were passive about their own equality and weren't really going to push for it, or who failed to see the connection between their own struggle, our own struggle, and the struggles of all the other communities out there that are seeking justice. So Bob was a man of incredible anger, but he was also just one of the sweetest, most lovely human beings I have ever met. And I only had the privilege of knowing him for, for two years, but I learned how much he loved his friends, and how much he loved his giants, how much he loved San Francisco, and how much he loved the Eagle, um, and how upset, he, how upset he would be about the loss of the Eagle, and how much he loved his activists, and he loved the kind of people who are in this room. And that's why I think Bob, throughout his life, always tried to be a mentor. I know he was a mentor to me. I know he would be so proud of Stephanie Ashley. He loved Stephanie. Um, and, and he would be so, so glad to see all of you here. So I, I want to wish, I want to say goodbye to Bob. And I want to wish all of us a life that is as impactful and as filled with rage and love as, as Bob's was.